Hey guys, Cindy Utter here with my Artsy Endeavors. How are you today? I'm doing pretty good. I have to show you this little project that I decided to work on. This is another one of those tag books that my friend uh, Vicki Brown, which is um, Messy Desk Studio, I believe, um, she sent me these. I was talking to her about wanting to do tags and have a book to put them in. And the thought was for my ABCs. Well, then um, she decided, or she sent me a couple of them. And I have this um, little container. And, and <laughs> why I still have this, I don't know. Um, apparently, I've carried this container around with me for years. And what it has in it is it has all of these do you guys remember these these were back in the 80s um, these were from 1983 and every week in the newspaper they would print a love is um, it says uh, the LA Times syndicate 1983 um, but they would print these well I went through and I actually counted these and I have 80 of these babies <laughs> So I decided that I wanted to, um, I really wanted to preserve these in the way they are. So what I decided to do was, um, I'm actually using some watercolors on them, and I'm just putting them in this tag book slash love is book, okay? Now, what I started doing, and I just did this one. I haven't done any more because I wanted to do them on camera and I wanted to share them with you guys. But um, these are index cards. Uh, the other day I was playing with stamps and my little 3x5 jelly plate. And these are, when I was done with a color or done playing around with a color, I took these index cards. They're playing on both sides. And I decided to um, start cleaning off my jelly plate using these cards. So what I'm going to do is these cards fit perfectly in this little tag book. I'm just looking for the ones that have um, the front and the back done. I'm going to have to do some more playing with my jelly plate because I have a bunch of them that are just fronts. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play around with these. I'm going to use some of my watercolors. I've got uh, Jane Davenport watercolor uh, markers and I also have the... Um, Bean Fang, I believe. They're a speedball watercolor. And that's what I plan on using. Here they are. They're the speedball watercolor pens. And that's what I plan on using. Maybe some washi. Um, I'm just going to have fun playing with this. I want to... There's another one with two. These are all one-sided. Um, I just want to play and I want to preserve these guys and just put them in a spot where I can go back and flip through them later on. So um, the very first one I did is Love Is Letting Her Volley at the Net. All right, and this one does not have a back done on it, so I am gonna have to do a jelly plate, some type of a print on here, a little bit of paint, just to give it some color in the background. And then I'm gonna do them front and back. Now the reason I'm doing them front and back, like I said, is because I have about 80 of these. Um, what I wanted to see, and I haven't tried it out yet. I'm going to hold off. <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> I'm going to hold off on beading this until after the book is done. And my dear friend Vicki, the same person that sent me this book, is also sending me some of her handmade paper beads. So I want to put them on the, on the spine. Um, all right, so like I said, I wanted to do the back. I want to find out. Every one of her tag books has this little pocket here. And I'm curious. Bingo! Look at that. We can do another one right there. And I'm pretty sure all of the pockets are the same. They are. So this is going to be a nice little project that I'm going to play with now and again. And I'm going to make these little love is peoples and just make a little memory collection. All right, so I'm going to fast forward through the process. I'm going to play a little bit, and uh, I just wanted to introduce this new series to you. Now, I'm going to have to, I would love to name it just Love Is, but I don't want any copyright information, you know, infringement. So um, I'll figure out something that will have the Love Is in the title, and uh, that way you guys can check it out. I hope you guys enjoy.